Do these jingles take you back to the ice cream truck coming around the corner? Now you can easily make your favourite childhood dessert with the Breville Smart Scoop. It's the first compressor ice cream maker with load sensing that lets you set and forget. This banana frozen yoghurt recipe is one of many sure crowd pleasing favourites that are included in the recipe section of the instruction booklet. Place the paddle securely into the 1.5 quart bowl. The outside needs to be completely dry or the water can turn to ice and cause it to get stuck. Pour the mixture into the ice cream bowl and place it into the smart scoop. Then choose from the 12 hardness settings. Turn the dial to the right for harder textured dessert like gelato or ice cream and dial to the left for softer sorbet and this frozen yogurt. If you want to tailor to your preferred consistency or for a pre-timed recipe, you can mix in manual mode. The optional pre-cool function can be used before both manual and automatic settings and only takes about 10 minutes to cool. That same button can activate the child lock by holding it down for two seconds. To make it faster, I'm definitely going to press pre-cool. Great for entertaining, the keep cool setting will keep the consistency of the dessert by chilling and churning for up to three hours. There's also an option to switch between Fahrenheit and Celsius. But to alert you to when your dessert's ready, the big decision remains to choose from the jingles, beeps or a mute option but that doesn't really scream ice cream. Ice cream usually takes about 50 minutes to churn and chill, but if your recipe calls for chocolate chips, fresh fruit or flavorings, there'll be a ding at about three to five minutes just before your ice cream reaches its desired consistency. When it's done, remove blade will flash. Use the included spatula to remove the frozen dessert from the bowl into a freezer container. You can immediately serve or since it's all natural and free from stabilizers and preservatives, it will store for one week in the freezer. To prevent ice crystals from forming, put plastic film directly over the top before storing in the freezer. The bowl should be hand washed. Use the included bottle brush to clean inside of the scraper blade. The Smart Scoop, brought to you by the Food Thinkers of Breville. Introducing the Von Chef Premium Ice Cream Maker, a must have for every lover of cold desserts. The Von Chef Premium Ice Cream Maker lets you create delicious and professional tasting ice cream in the comfort of your own kitchen. Featuring a built-in compressor which can mix and freeze 1.5 litres of ice cream in as little as 60 minutes. Unlike with some other ice cream makers, you don't need to worry about pre-freezing the bowl for hours before you can use it. Great for making those last-minute dessert decisions. An easy to read LCD display and timer, which can be set to 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 or 60 minutes, makes the ice cream maker incredibly easy. A powerful yet quiet 50 decibel motor makes the ice cream maker a really convenient choice for the modern household. No need to worry about disturbing the rest of the household when you want to indulge in your sweet tooth. Controlling exactly what goes into your ice cream is one of the many fantastic benefits of the ice cream maker and a great way of avoiding the preservatives and additives which many store-bought ice creams contain. Not only can you make delicious ice cream, you can also make mouth-watering frozen yogurts and sorbets. Experiment with all different kinds of ingredients. Fruits, syrups and chocolates are great for traditional recipes. If you want to try something a little different, why not try the popular chili and chocolate combination? Delicious! Bring the ice cream parlour into your own home with the Von Chef Premium Ice Cream Maker. The one-of-a-kind revolutionary ice cream depot is one appliance that you'll wonder how you ever did without. And the best part? It is easy to set up, easy to use and has parts which are all dishwasher safe. The on-off switch is located here. When you press the switch, there will be a three second delay before the fan comes on. The machine will actually display the wash mode. Pushing the up and down buttons will change the display. 
Press the up or down button to match the number on the front of the package of the mix. Combine the mix with the correct amount of liquid and whisk. When the mix is thoroughly blended, just pour into the top of the SX-1000. Now, just press the start-stop button. This will start the freezing process and will turn on the compressor as well as the stirring motor. You will see the timer start to count down. A buzzer will sound. Now your delicious frozen product is ready. And you can either enjoy it right now or do nothing. And the SX-1000 goes into the stay fresh mode. Now you're probably thinking, here comes the hard part, cleaning it all out. But with SX-1000, cleanup is a breeze. Just press the start stop button and the display will change to 03 and start flashing. The heating element and stirring motor will turn on for three minutes. The buzzer will sound. Press the start stop button again and you are now in rinse mode. Just pour in fresh water and dispense until it runs clear. And even better, all of the parts of the Ice Cream Depot SX-1000 are completely dishwasher safe. The hardest part of the whole process? Deciding what flavor to try next. Enjoy. Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart Pure Indulgence 2-Quart Ice Cream Maker. You can also use it to make sorbet. So it's simple and easy to use. i show you the parts. This is your paddle, which is going to mix um, your ice cream as it's freezing. This is your freezer bowl. You can tell it's all nice and icy. We left it in the freezer overnight. That's the best thing to do. Um, and then you're going to just put the paddle in like so and you put the lid on and you just twist to put it in. The lid also has a nice large um, hole in the top and that is um, great for adding um, some of your ingredients in at the end or even when the machine's mixing. So you can pour your uh, liquid ice cream base in there or um, as you get towards the end of your ice cream being finished, you can add things like nuts or little M&Ms. Um, so that's a lot of fun to do. It's all stainless steel housing. It has a really simple operation. All you do is turn it on with this and, and you turn it off when it's done. So let's go ahead and make some ice cream. So this base was made earlier. We have lots of great recipes in the instruction booklet. And make sure that um, whatever base you're using, whether you're making it um, a cooked base, more like a custard, or just with fresh milk, make sure the ingredients are cold and chilled before you add them to the ice cream maker. So this happens to be a um, fresh strawberry um, ice cream base. What we're going to do is we're going to let that mix for about 20-25 minutes. We're going to come back and check on it and it's going to be finished. So let's check on our strawberry ice cream. I'm going to turn this off. Um, it was uh, mixing for about 20-25 um, minutes. I'm going to give it a little taste. It's really sweet and nice and airy. The thing that you should do now is remove it from this freezer bowl, put it in a food storage container, put it in the freezer and it'll harden up nice and hard and you can enjoy your homemade ice cream. <laughs> 